You need a choreographer. <laughs> there we go. Um, so I am, um, I love Gene. He's my buddy. And uh, and we were of a similar nature. We were both kind of lacrimose and despondent. And, and, uh, and um, I forgot to talk to him at the And uh, one day I called him up and I said, Gene, can you come over to my house and bring your car out? Empty your car out and come run over? And he said, yeah. Why? I said, my dad won't let me move. I keep saying, Dad, I, I got to, I said, guess what? it's about time I move because I'm getting older now. And he's, my dad says, no, your place is here. Your place is here until you graduate from college. And I, my dad did not know that I already dropped out of college. <laughs> So I called up Gene, Gene came over and got me, we loaded everything in his car, drove it over to his house, put it in the garage, came back and got the rest of my stuff, drove it over to his house, put it in the garage, and then Gene had a little room outside the, the house, which was really nice, it was like a little club house room, but that's where he slept. There were two beds in there, so that's where I slept. So every night, oh, we practice during the day, we write songs and we talk about, wow, when we get like... A good guitar, everything's going to be all right. <laughs> or when our hair touches our ear, everything's going to be all right. We just always knew that stuff was going to be all right. And, you know, when you get a first hit record, everything's going to be all right. It never was. Nothing ever changed. It's kind of, it's, it's kind of the way the world is. They, they think, when I marry that beautiful chick, everything's going to be all right. It, it's not. It's just you got, you're married to that beautiful chick, you know. So, anyway... <laughs> Every, every night I'd go in the house and sit down at the dinner table and have dinner with his mother and father. And one night his mom says, Larry, are you living here? <laughs> and I said, yeah. She says, well, you can't live here. <laughs> you can't. Where am I going to live? I don't know, but you can't live here. Gosh, I have to live someplace. Where is, where is there an empty space on earth that I can live? So I, I didn't know. So I went up to the little room, looked around it, you know, kind of like, goodbye room. And, and Jean comes out and I say, well, Jean, um, I'm leaving. And Jean says, I'm going with you. <laughs> so he both took all of our stuff and we went, we put it in somebody else's garage. <laughs> and we did that for a few times until we got a job singing in a band called People. And then we had our own space and we put our junk in our own space. Uh, and, and I want Jean to sing this, I want him to sing the lead. And I'll be his backup girl singer. You're <laughs> <coughs> a fine looking one you are. Yes, I do, but the words won't come. And I don't know what you say. I should tell you, I love you, I do. The words should explain, but the words won't come. If you can see what you mean to me, the words should explain, but the words won't come. I should tell you.
Yes, I do, but the words won't come And I don't know what to say I shouldn't hide my love deep inside The words should explain, but the words won't come If you could see what you mean to me The words should explain, but the words won't come I know how hard I tried to tell Yes, I do. Yeah, I've got a clear watch sign. <laughs> <laughs>